Today we are in Midway to do a tiny little secret that has been revealed to me by a good friend of mine standing behind the camera. Stay tuned, we're not going to give you a complete history because even though some of you may know it, for the general rest of you want to try and keep it a little bit secretive and you'll probably find out why at the end of the video. So please stay towards the end of the video because there is a sort of caveat to all of this that we just want to make everybody really aware of and hopefully you can respect it. I know all of you out there who watch my channel are really respectful and really decent people and I'm really hoping you can stick to that and obviously just take my word for it and hopefully we'll be okay. But we're in a wonderful Medway, obviously above us, just in case you didn't know, is uh, Fort Amherst. So yeah, take a look with us. Let's go for a mini explore. Come on. Hello everybody, hope you're doing really well. Uh, today I've got a real nice little treat for you and I just want to thank the camera lady behind me, Jade, who's a superstar today to be honest with you. She's been featured behind the scenes in a couple of other Midway videos from the past. Um, she politely sent me over a photo of what we're just about to just check out. It's very small and tiny but it's probably quite cool. We're going to keep it relatively secret because really actually from looking at it there's been recent habitation from homeless people so we were trying just keep a little bit on par with that. A couple of little things to show you though. Basically, we are in Midway right now, and we are just off centre from some of the sort of like more heavier pot fortification parts of Midway, and that'll probably be the only clue that we sort of politely give you. What's really interesting about this is it, it it's not that big, and the brickwork and everything else is fascinating, and it probably gives us more of a more of a sort of um, indicator of what period of time this is. I did look on some old maps before Jade sort of sent me over some stuff and actually interestingly enough this place on the old maps doesn't exist which means it can only be technically military based because obviously they wanted to try and hide it a little bit. A nice little sort of drop in as well which is pretty cool but um, it's going to be quite a brief video so come with us and I'll show you what we're looking at today. Uh, the first thing we need to show you however is this just in quite incredible fossilised spider which is the first one we've had. So let's check it up here. So if you can see that everyone, that's coming out alright. So basically what's happened is, is the water sort of like come down, it's sort of fossilised the old spider, bless it. So as it's passed away it's found a and a new, new life. So, uh, yeah, very, very cool. <laughs> First of channel, we don't normally see that. So, as you can see, we're in, <laughs> keep forgetting about that one, right? Now. Uh, we're in what looks like a sort of cellar, um, but actually, probably more than likely, as you can see these arches, and there are obviously some buildings above us. But we're just going to put it down to definitely some form of this well. We're assuming it's probably like military more in origin itself, but just for example, I mean, we can look, it's hard to sort of say much without. Oh, look, it's another one in there. <laughs> They're everywhere. <laughs> um, but sadly, uh, I've got to be really careful because we are quite worried that there might be someone here at some point. Um, you see, there's a lot of workings that have been going on down here as well. We're, we're obviously like doing some heavy engineering works and stuff, which I know from memory what this used to be above us. Oh, sorry, thank you very much. There are spider webs completely above. <laughs> you can see that this, we've noticed this, isn't it? Loads and loads of uh, car freshers that people have been collecting. There's some over there as well. They clearly wanted it to smell nice in here for whatever reason. But uh, yeah, so what it does, you've got to be careful with the old spider webs here. Um, what it does is it basically just opens up into this bigger section and that's pretty much it and then you can see what looks to be more of a defensive turret I mean I'm assuming a turret, sorry what I'm talking about um, gun, gun, musket, firing thingy oh my god look at that oh, didn't actually notice that it actually goes up we can't get up there today, which is a bit of a mess. Oh, there you go. Some people have done it. Oh, it does look down there. So, potentially an HQ and stuff. Oh, 
Beautiful part of the old fort though. Assuming the ground level probably would have been a lot lower when you sort of look at that where that comes to. That's probably about right actually. Probably might be just a tad bit lower. But yeah, pretty much it. Isn't it? Right, so wait, go on. <laughs> uh, basically, that's pretty much it, everyone. If you want to just scooch across there and everything else. fortifications from uh, Midway. Hopefully you really like that. I want to talk to you about something in a minute when we get out and we'll explain that uh, when we're there. So stay tuned and uh, let's, let's head out. Come on. So um, hopefully you really enjoyed that lovely little bit of uh, Napoleonic history, I suppose you'll sort of say about it. Um, so like I said, please if you know that little bit there, just please keep it a secret to yourself. It's really important that we try and preserve these types of things as best as possible. But the reason why I've brought you to this wonderful little conclusion, I apologise to the wind by the way. Um, I want to make it really clear on this one that we're pretty sure there are a few homeless people that are pretty much using that facility. Uh, Jade had mentioned that before, when from visiting it first time and then showing me a second time, there have been some significant sort of like movement in terms of homelessness taking place. So please, like I said, just show a little bit of respect whilst you're there. We're pretty sure they're sort of, they are residing somewhere in there. So again, you know, just please be respectful for it. Um, but yeah, nice little treat, wasn't it, really? Uh, nice little bit of Hidden Midway, which obviously sums up Phoenix history. Just want to say massive thanks to Jade, who's behind the camera, which is kind of a bit weird. Uh, but thank you, sir. And uh, thank you, obviously, to all of you lot watching out there. Stay tuned for some more interesting videos on Phoenix history, because history matters. It really does, doesn't it? Take care, everybody. Midway, here we go. Right, cup out. We can do this, don't it? <laughs> <laughs>